The world is asking one question. Why did I attack the United States? The United States has had the world in a constant state of war for over a hundred years. Time and again, we have seen the catastrophic results of this belligerent militaristic policy. These wars haven't led to resolution or peace. These wars have only led to more wars. The United States has set the agenda because they wielded the biggest stick. Well, no more. This is not the beginning of a war. This is the end of all wars. After San Francisco, the entire free world turned against Atlas. Irons entrenched himself at his headquarters in New Baghdad. All communications ceased. Both sides knew what was coming. Our mission was to fly in with the 37th Airborne during the initial shock and awe campaign. From there, we would break off and infiltrate the Atlas Command Center, taking out Irons. For Cormac, it was the end of a journey. He'd been waiting five years for this day. Last minute change of plan. We'll be flanking around from the east and the north, covering blue team on their sortie over the target. Yes, sir. I guess I've got the soft option. There are no soft options on the table. I just don't want all my assets in play at once. We're only gonna have one shot at getting the bastard. That's all we'll need. I know it. Just stay alive. You're our star witness when we drag his ass in front of the Hague. Looking forward to it. All right, good luck. There was nothing more to say. We all knew what had to be done. This was the beginning of the end. For one of us. Kingpin, Sentinel 2-1, approaching APC Romeo Victor North at Angels 5. Roger that. Maintain low-level flight from there to New Baghdad. Kingpin out. Sentinel flight. Fence in. Engage anything that doesn't have a sentinel beacon. Three bandits ahead. Twelve above low. Time to start pumping heads. Make sure we'll watch your wing. Airborne bearing 3-1-5. I'm being painted. Watch those traces. Roger, Harry. Thanks for the cover fire, you saved my tail. Four bandits coming over the ridge at 2 o'clock. Got one. That's a slope. Bravo, Zoom. Slack ahead. Stay below it. Use your blower to power blast. Mitchell, watch that flat. Trailing drones ahead. Four bandits coming in at 12 o'clock. Engage your will. Got one. I'll take the right cap. Taking the left. Watch your six, Mitchell. Drop down the head. Close the debris. Watch your head, Mitchell. Mitchell, stay in the canyon. Heads up. Closing hydroelectric gang. Lock onto those hard points and hit it with your missile. Target destroyed. Right take. Watch out for the train. Stay in play. Lock onto those hard points and hit them with your missiles. Target down. Right safe. Watch out for the train. Target control. Find it closing in in the sink, Mitchell. See it clear. Watch your tail, Mitchell. Bravo. Red Heavy debris. Race in maneuvers. That was mine. 12 o'clock. Four bears. Great shit. Crossing ACP-5. Coming back around. Six o'clock high. Target down. Getting close to use your guns. Target destroyed. Bravo, suit. We're bounding the flank position. Guys out of the front. Got one. Stay focused. We're almost through this. Come on. This is Sentinel-01. Final approach to New Baghdad. Copy, Zero-One. 
Enemy air defense perimeter in 1.5 clicks. Commencing drop sequence. Autopilot engaged. On deployment successful. 1,200 meters to target. Minimizing system power. Switching over to low detection. Copy all, zero 01. Your squad is off the radar. Magnetic at Cherub Spore. Distance two nautical miles from the target. Over. Connecting the heads up to the battlefield network. Our main target is Atlas Command Center, where Irons is directing the war effort from deep inside. Multiple MD turrets have been placed as air defenses around the city. We need to take them out in order to reach the command center. Distance to target 200 meters. Switch off heads up and prepare for touchdown. Advancing to the operations center. Clear out the 